Dallas, you, how you doing tonight? Come on. The E! News anchor and cancer survivor Juliana Ranzik flew down to the bayou to talk about leadership and ethics. When I go to the gym in the morning and I leave, I, I, I say I'm grateful for my legs, that I could run on the treadmill today, and that I felt strong. If you literally say what you're grateful for, not material things, but what you're grateful for, it's amazing how things just start coming back to you. The lectureship motivated LSU student Morgan Trappin to work harder. I just thought she did a great job of getting her word out there, just letting everyone know that, you know, hard work and determination can get you a lot of places. The Delta Gamma fraternity hosted the lectureship in Values and Ethics. This is an example of the Greek leadership opportunities that attract many young women to join LSU Greek organizations. This year, more than a thousand ladies participated in sorority recruitment to be a part of Sorority Row. Miller Hall residential assistant Kim Allen says positive connections she's seen from freshmen joining sororities. I think it gives them a group of people to transition with, and I think positively it does give them a base group of friends and a connection already. Ranzik advises students to work hard now and in the future because they never know who's watching. Give it your all, you know, and, and, and just leave, make a good impression, you know, and it sounds so simplistic, like it sounds like the, easy, like the most ridiculous advice ever, but I can't tell you how often it doesn't happen that way. Freshman Kappa Delta Catherine Estopinol says she admires the hard work of the older girls in her sorority. A lot of girls in the sorority have like 4.0s and so that helps you, you know, like you want to push and like they get recognized in the sorority so like you want to put, you want to be, push yourself to like get recognized. Reporting for Tiger TV, I'm Michelle A. Jackson.